You're watching Roll for Crit, and I am going to give you a little tour as well as my impressions of the Root box insert published by eRaptor. So Root, the game from Leader Games, one of our favorites here at Roll for Crit. Uh, everybody has a different asymmetric faction, and of course there's a bunch of expansions, so uh, there's a lot of things to try to fit into the box. And this insert does, to an extent at least, cover all of the current expansions as of today's date, but we do know there are more coming in the future. So let's see what's actually inside the box. Uh, I have put together this insert in advance so you can see what the final product looks like once it's in, again, the original base core root box. Uh, over on this side, you have slots for all the different card types in the game, uh, all of the different specific faction cards, as well as the generic cards that everybody can be drawing from. I also have this uh, some bonus deck that you can alternately swap in that they came out with later. Uh, and then you have these cards over here, which some are for uh, the uh, solo mode of the game, the mechanical marquees, different mechanical versions of, of characters. So all that stuff fits over here. Uh, again, mine are unsleeved, but sleeved will fit in there as well. And then everything over here is just all the different factions in the game. Well, this one actually has some dice in it that everyone's gonna be using, but the rest of it, you've got all the different factions. Each one has their own unique tray, and each tray fits in all of their uh, components except for their cards. So all their tokens, all the little wooden meeples that are gonna go onto the map. Uh, there's a tray for everybody. So if you want an easy setup uh, and tear down, you just hand these out to people and then put everything back into their trays when they're done. Each character does have uh, slightly different sizes of them, and there's a chance that some of mine are not in the right sizes because it's kind of hard to tell exactly where all of them are supposed to go, but you can make it work. They're, they're generally pretty good at being able to fit into those spots. And down at the bottom here, you see uh, you've got some more stuff like the item tokens that people are gonna be using, different things for specific factions down here. This is also something that I kind of crammed in here. I have these nice 3D resin markers for the uh, different spaces for the, the fox symbol, the rabbit symbol, etc., cetera, uh, which uh, I made work. I made work. Uh, these are not something everybody might have, but uh, they, they will fit if you're a little bit creative and you stuff them into there in the different ways that I've done. But you can see all that stuff fits in here. The one thing that does not fit in this box is the rule books as well as the player boards. So the actual faction boards each person has that walk them through uh, the different rule sets and everything. And sometimes you, you, know, you need those, you use those to mark things for your faction as the game goes on. There's just too much stuff in Root. So even with this insert, you're still going to need, hopefully you've saved maybe uh, one of the expansion boxes or something to store all of that stuff. And of course, there is more Root coming in the future. There are more uh, factions on the way. So if that's something that you're planning on picking up, Keep in mind, this insert is not future-proofed. I mean, it's filled to the brim as it is. I don't know how they could possibly fit more in this box. So that's something that you'll have to worry about at a later date. Uh, maybe you could, I don't know, you could swap out. Maybe you just keep your favorite factions in this box and you get a separate box for everything else. Maybe they'll have a solution for that later on. We don't know yet. But as it stands for the current root content, uh, I think this is pretty much as good as you can get for a root insert. Again, with the caveat that some of that other stuff you are going to have to keep separate just because there is so much and the original root box isn't that big. Uh, but that's a look at the root insert. Um, so far I'm pretty pleased with it. It does the job uh, considering the limitations that they have in place. But let me know in the comments if you've tried out this root insert or if you have any plans to future proof your own sets and uh, let us know what you think. I'm Jonathan. This has been Roll for Crit. Hey, why don't you like this video for us to help us out or even subscribe to the channel or even support us on Patreon where for just a few bucks a month you can get some really cool extra content. We also do live streams on our Twitch channel and a separate YouTube channel. You can find links to that in the description. You definitely want to catch us playing board games and video games over there.